Hey, how's it going? Welcome back to Pixar. Going to be trying to tame a manta ray today. So they kind of spawned in right after I ended the last video. So we're going to go ahead and make the saddle, repair our scuba gear, and probably head out on the megalodon here. I haven't done any more leveling on him really. I just got back to base here and wanted to empty the inventory. I had to get the penguins refilled over there on meat. I think I'm going to stop producing some of the polymer soon because... I mean, we got quite a bit of it, and it's just, it's piling up so quick. So, we need to get some of the shark skin, and then what else do we need? A little bit of fiber, iron ingot, oh, we do need polymer. A little bit of fiber. I think it was iron, right? And I need to get a tool. I think I made another one, didn't I? Yes, I do. We're going to keep that on us this time, just in case everything breaks. Well, not everything. It's the tank here that I'm kind of worried about. Wait, what am I missing? Oh, I need chitin. I think we have some in here. Yeah, let's take a stack of that. We shouldn't be overweighted. Yeah, we're doing pretty good on weight. All right, repair you. You and you. Gonna say, is something wrong with it? Nice. So we only need a couple of everything. Let's get rid of a little bit of the weight. Just mainly because, well, not weight reasons, but in case we die. And how much is it for the polymer? Oh, it doesn't say because I've already repaired it. We're not gonna take that many, as well as the skins, too. That should be enough of all that. So let's throw a little bit more of the fiber out. And get rid of some of these ingots. I think it was only like four to repair it. Nice. Let's unlock the mantis saddle. Ooh, mantis. I do want to tame one of those, but that's not what we're looking for. So we're going to need some chitin, copper, and leather. And where's that made? In our inventory, it looks like. Copper. Was it leather and chitin? I just put all that chitin back in there. Very simple to make. I like it. What else did we have? Copper. Let's get rid of that. We should have enough of our arrows and all that stuff still. That's awesome that the crossbow doesn't break, you know? I think that's it. Let's go ahead and get our gear on. Good to go. And what are we going to need to tame it? Maybe we should grab some of the prime meat. <sighs> he runs so slow, man. With, uh, with the fins on. You can hear him breathing hard. <laughs> it's like a chore. All right, dude, let's try not to get you killed this time, please. That would be fantastic. All right, so we're heading all the way back down this direction and to the left. And probably not take out anything along the way. I do need to level this guy, but I'm really curious about the Manta. What it's going to be like for his health and his damage mainly. Carry capacity, I'm not expecting that to be too big with him, but we'll have to see. Never know. And my raft, man. My raft is still out somewhere over here. All right, let's give it a second. Takes things a minute to spawn in, it seems, in Pixar. I wish it was kind of like Ark, where whenever you actually go to an area and stuff spawns in, that it actually stays and doesn't disappear. And there's one there. Nice. What level are you? Oh, I can't use it on... There we go. You're level 3. You are definitely not going to do. And you're 57. You will do. Let's get this over here. There's actually a couple of them there. So since we haven't taken any type of damage or done any damage, we should be alright with him. Putting him into a Pix block.
Nice. And we need to figure out which one was which here. You're a 46, and... You're the 57. You're the one we want. And hopefully I don't get aggro from the other one, which I did. Dude, these dolphins, man, they're... They're ridiculous. Dude, the health on these are, like, crazy. But their torpor is not very high. A couple more arrows and he should be out. Oh, there's a shark just spawned in. Yep, yep, yep. He's almost ready to take a nap. Oh, wait. Wrong one. Dude, would y'all spread out a little bit? Oh, there's three of them now. Come on, dude. <laughs> it's like triplets. All right, he's running. That's good. Be able to keep him kind of separate. Dude, we got to get up to 6,000. Holy crap. I didn't realize it was that much. I thought it was a lot lower. I wonder if there's harpoons in this for underwater, you know? Kind of like Ark has for underwater taming. Oh, man. Oh, dude. We're about to die. I did not realize that. Oh. Oh, don't jump down there. That would be... Yeah, that would be not, not good at all. So the 57 is the one we want. If he just stays there, that would be good. What is that? Oh, it's a Parasaur. If it was a Megalodon, they'd be running right now because it's like as soon as you get out of water... They kind of leave the area. See, well, let's eat some meat. Help our health regen a little bit, I think. Yeah, we're getting our health back. Man, it gets back so much faster in this than Ark does. It's very nice. Was that something hitting me? I don't know what that was. Okay, he's running. Oh, we need to go for him. And not get hit by anything. Dude, I'll just gonna take like a couple more hits and we're gonna be dead. I think we can outrun him as long as we watch our stamina. Oh my gosh, there's a lot of stuff there to run from though. Is that him? That is him. Oh, is he out? Nice, he's out. Okay, cool. Uh, we need to kill everything off that's around here. That's the thing. I see you there, buddy. Wonder if we go to this side, if it'll kind of... get him to follow, then we'll run to the other side. I just want to put some food in the dude. And he should be alright then. Yeah, come over this way, guys. Wonder what's in this drop. I'll take that. Is there a bird saddle? Oh, we'll hold on to it. Alright, we're gonna run over here, try to get some food in him, and get back out of the water before we get hit by anything. Oh, I didn't bring any berries with me either in case he needs it. We'll do six. That should be enough. Cool, and we didn't get aggro from nothing else. Awesome! That did work. What level is that shark? I really want one of the blue ones, man. 34. I think the one we have is a little bit higher level. Alright, I'm gonna sit here, as usual. Let him tame up, and hopefully not get aggro from anything. I'm kind of worried about him getting hit as a thing. Alright, maybe I should get out of the water. I think he's safe from, like, the sharks. We'll see. At least there's none of the hippos over here. What those things are such a pain. Nice, and there we go. He did not take long at all. Turns out I already had that floor blueprint. Oh, dude. Oh, wait, that's mine. <laughs> I was getting all worried. Oh, man. Dude, here it goes again with him. Attacking stuff. Oh, he's wrecking face, though, on that shark. Say, well, let's go ahead and just kill him, man. Do your thing. Take out this dude, though. 
He's the one that's hurting me. There you go. Manta on Manta action. I don't know if it's actually going to help with me being in there. Dude, come on. Don't die. Please don't die. Well, I mean, me either. Me either. Yeah, I need to leave that alone. If I die, it's all over. I can't really whistle passive to them. They're they're kind of different than Ark. You can't whistle that far. What's hitting me? Buffer fish. All right, which one's a saddle for the Manta? That one, okay, right next to the polymer. Ah, I want to get in there and get a saddle on them, but. He keeps running away too fast. I mean, I could try to put the other one to sleep, I guess. Oh, now there's a... An angler fish. Should have brought some regular arrows, I think. Yeah, come with me, man. Leave those guys alone. Oh, there we go. Passive. Okay. I couldn't hotkey it, I know. Yeah, come with me. We ain't worried about the little angler fish, man. We want to get away from that manta. All right, let's get the saddle on you. Nice. How's your health? You are almost dead. Oh, my gosh. All right, let's get over here out of the way. It seems like everything underwater I tame <laughs> ends up dying. Ah. Uh, let's get over here where nothing will spawn in on us. Dude, he is fast, so man. Oh, man. So much faster than the Meg. All right, so it is a level 66. Health is 11,700. Stamina is 760. Weight is 840. And damage is 230%. Let's force feed him a little bit of food. Just so he doesn't die. Um, Yeah, we'll force feed him these two. And I don't have anything else for you, buddy. Let's see how much damage you do, and then we'll put some points into stuff. Wonder if we can find something that's not too aggressive. Maybe some dolphins to munch on. That that would be fantastic. Dude, it looks awesome though, man. It's a lot bigger than I thought it was gonna be. And the speed, too. Looks like his stamina is pretty good. We might not need to up that. I'll have to see how it is when we start attacking stuff. Dude, is there nothing in this little river? I don't think there is. Let his stamina come back a little bit. All right, let me try to find something to munch on, and we'll do some testing. We'll see how he does fighting and put a point into... I want to put one into health and one into damage to see what the difference is. How many points does he have? We got nine available. Let's do health now. So 11,700. That actually goes up quite a bit on him. That goes up almost 200 points. And then for stamina, that goes up drastically. I don't want to mess with weight because there's not really anything we need to farm underwater where we would need more weight. So we'll probably leave that like it is right now. All right, I'm going to find something to munch on and we'll test his damage out. All right, so I went way down that river and nothing spawned in. This goes back out to the ocean where we just ran from. Let's test out on this angler. See what damage we do, if we can even bite him. So 43, wait. Nah, 274 is us, 43 was the angler. Oh, we can't go backwards, that kinda. So 274. That only goes up like 4%. Can you harvest anything down there? Tell you what, let me jump off and harvest this because he's really needing some food. Oh, did he already harvest it? Well, I guess he did. Ah, oh, I didn't get much from it though. Alright, so it's 274. Let's find something else to munch on. This should be the open ocean right up here though. Yeah, here we go. Buffer fish will work. 
Come here, man. Let me munch on your tail a little bit. 280. So that goes up six points. Hmm. Not as much as I would like. However, it is an awesome underwater mount, and we just got a ton of meat from that one puffer fish. Dude, I might be able to do harvesting for those under here. Let's put a bunch into damage. That gets us up to 264%. 315. I, I usually try to aim for around 300% whenever I'm doing stuff in art uh, on my team. So that should be fine, actually. And those puffer fish is what I need to come down here to harvest to keep the penguins supplied because it takes me forever on land to get anything. Any large amount of meat, you know? Yeah! Nice! All these dolphins coming in. Poor dudes never stood a chance. Dude, get off my meat blocks, man. Those are mine. Worked hard for them. I wonder how he, he stands up towards a hippo, if there is one around. Get the rest of this little bit of meat here real quick. That bone, too, man. That's what I use for making all that polymer. I won't have to use a penguin so much. I need to see if I don't fill up their food, if they'll actually die in that enclosure. I don't know if they will. It's kind of, uh... Kind of something I want to play with, but I don't want to lose my penguins at the same time. Let's see. So his weight is 840. It only goes up 40 pounds on each one. Not too much. But it's not too bad either. Oh, it's a level 76. I'm not going to kill you. I would like to tame you later. And an 87. Okay. We're going to leave those guys. But we did get us a Manta, man. And I do say it is a very nice mount for underwater. He can only go over stuff that's like two blocks high. I think it's got to be two or three if you're going over like a shallow area so he doesn't get stuck. But hope you enjoyed the video. I'm gonna go ahead and leave this one here. As always, thanks for watching, and we'll see you in the next one.